Hey guys, good morning. It's Freestyle. It's Tuesday, September the 22nd, and I'm up here on the summit of South Cracker Mountain in Maine, and I just want to show you guys the view that I've got. Now, what you're seeing out here is the you're seeing the uh, mountains that I hiked yesterday. Yesterday, we sort of came from over there, and we came up and over top of uh, Lone Mountain. That big bald one is Mount Abraham. I didn't hike up that one. It would have been like a two mile side trail. But I hiked along that ridge line up and over the crest of Spalding Mountain and then followed that ridge line along to the base of Sugarloaf. Sugarloaf's another ski resort. There seem to be ski resorts all over the place. But yeah, we didn't go up that too. We I basically came down the ravine and down to the Cassavasset River, then up to a campsite right at the base of the mountain. And then today, you know, came up here to South Crocker, and there's a side trail to the view that I'm here at now. And then I'm going to go up and over to North Crocker, then to Betty Crocker, then then we're going to go down to the town of Stratton. <laughs> I, I find it very funny that there's a Stratton, Maine. And then we're going to go up this mountain called the Horn to some lean-tos there. So like a 13-mile day. Yeah, no big. But I'm kind of like, I mean, it's cloudy today, but not raining. Thank goodness. It's just uh, kind of cold. It, it really has gotten cold. All that winter gear that I was carrying with me for so long, I finally now have a chance to use it. And uh, thank God for that Nano Puff jacket, I tell you. <laughs> but, uh, but, yeah. You know, the last couple days I was feeling in a bit of a funk. Uh, the reasons are important, but it really does mess with your uh, hiking. I mean, I was still hiking, but it just was, I was just like, you know, Arr. and uh, yesterday evening, about a half mile before the campsite, I ran into a girl southbound named Renbird, and we got to talk for a few minutes, and she was just a very happy, positive person, and she made my day, and I'd like to give a shout out to you, Renbird. And uh, I hope. Now, she had a very interesting story. She started through hiking eight years ago, but then she got to a certain point and she stopped. And then a few years ago, she came back to like hike the portion that she didn't, or that she hadn't finished. And then she had a few spare weeks, or for whatever reason, this year. And she decided to hike up Mount Katahdin and hike down to Grafton Notch and, you know, finally complete her hike eight years after the fact. And I think that that's. Uh, that's pretty cool. She's actually got a job this summer working as a hut master for some sort of outdoorsy hut in uh, Maine, which is pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, she just wants to sell her car and travel about. She wants to do the El Camino de Santiago, and I hope she gets there. I know she will. And yeah, it's just sort of, you know, Maine still has a few few curveballs to throw me, and I'm very happy about that. And uh, it's just sort of, yeah, it was nice. But anyway, that's all I had for you guys. I'll just give you one last look at this view. Remember, Mount Abraham, Spalding Mountain, Sugarloaf, South Crocker. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys have a lovely day. Bye.